Hello everyone! Today we are going to learn the common splices and joints in electricity and its procedure. In splicing wires, the materials we need are size 14 solid wire, side cutter, and an ordinary plier. Let us now first start with the rat tail or the pig tail. Rat tail or pig tail. This kind of joint is commonly used to join two or more conductors inside the junction box. First step is place the two ends of bare wire in cross position, then twist the bare conductors about 5 to 7 times by using a ordinary plier. Just twist it like this. When you reach the edge, use the other plier to hold the end. This. Then tighten the the conductor. Just like this. Then, cut the edge. This is the rat tail joint or the pig tail joint. Second is the Y splice. Y splice. This method of wrapping is generally used on small cables because the strands are flexible and can all be wrapped in one operation. In Y splice, first you place your wire in Y position like this, then hold it by using an ordinary plier. Then twist it around like this. Until you reach the end. This is what Y splice looks like when we reach the edge of the solid wire. Next, we have the plain top joint. Plain top joint. This is used where the top wire is under considerable tensile stress circuit. In doing the plain top joint, first, Put the wire on the top of the other wire. Then slowly twist it around. Use an ordinary flyer to hold the wire. Be careful in twisting the wire because it can harm you. When you reach the end, get the side cutter to hold the wire. When the wire is too short, it is the time for you to cut it using the side cutter. This is the plain top joint. Next is the cross joint. Cross joint. The same application is done as in plain top. But the only difference is that this top is a combination of two plain tops placed side by side with each other. In doing cross joint, you need a 2-end strip wire. First, 
Put the two strip wire in cross position. Turn the first strip wire in clockwise, then the other in counterclockwise. We do the first wire. Put the first wire on the top of the other wire. Use a plier to hold the wires. Then, twist it in clockwise. In doing cross joint, it is just like a plain top joint. When we reach the end, cut the excess wire. Now, let us move on to the second wire. Put the second wire beside the first wire and turn it in clockwise like this. Use a plier to hold the wires. Be careful in twisting the wire because it can harm you. Slowly twist the wire in counterclockwise. When we reach the end, cut the excess wire. This is the cross joint. SIG is the Western Union Long Tie. Western Union Long Tie. This is used extensively for outside wiring to extend the length of wire from one end to another. In doing Western Union Long Tie, we need two strip wire. First, put the wires into cross position, then slowly twist it like this. Be careful in twisting the wire because it can harm you. Use the two pliers to tighten the wires. The wire should be like this. Then twist it around in counterclockwise and clockwise. Use an ordinary plier to hold the wire. Then twist it slowly. Used again a plier to hold the wires. Then, when you reach the both end, do not forget to cut the excess wires. Use a side cutter to cut the wires. This is the Western Union long tie.
Last is the Western Union short tie. Western Union short tie splice. This is the most widely used splice or joint in interior wiring installation to extend the length of wire from one point to another. In doing Western Union short tie, we need also to strip wire. First, put the wire in cross position, then twist it like this. The difference between Western Union long tie and Western Union short tie, Western Union long tie is twist 5 times. Unlike in Western Union short tie, we twist it in 3 times. Use the two pliers to tighten the wires. The wire should be look like this. Then, twist it around in clockwise and counterclockwise. Use an ordinary plier to hold the wire, then twist it slowly. Then, cut the excess wire. Use again the ordinary plier to hold the wire. And when you reach the end, cut the excess wire. This is the Western Union short tie. Let's go back of what we have done. The Y splice. Western Union short tie. The cross joint. Knotted top. Western Union long tie Plain top joint And the rat tail or pig tail